you just swipe down, swipe over, and tap screen record. All right, so I just finished my update to Android version 11, which came out, I believe today, out of beta form. For Pixel users first, of course, and then it's going to be coming to other phones. One of the things I was really excited about in Android 11 was the fact that I was supposed to be able to screen record directly from the phone without using a third-party app. And uh, with a little screen record magic here, I will show you exactly uh, how I did that. Here we go. And while we're here, before we get started, uh, click that like button and subscribe to us below. Mm -hmm. All right, so to get to the screen record settings, you just swipe down from up top. I've already did this, of course, but you click your little edit icon right there in the corner, and uh, your screen record will be right here under the hold and drag to add tiles. So uh, kind of like Nightlight, you just drag it up there and drop it in, and then you'll have a screen record button. Then, of course, to screen record, you just swipe down, swipe over, and tap screen record. When I tap it, it's going to tell me that it's going to stop. And that's essentially it. Once you have the screen record icon at the top of your phone, you swipe down, you click screen record, it'll look like this. It'll then pop open this menu asking you to allow the microphone and allow the screen recording. Uh, of course, if you're just going to do a voiceover, you can just turn off the mic. Or if you want to use the built-in mic, you can use the built-in mic. That choice is up to you. But once you click those settings and you click start, it does the countdown, three, two, one, and then you just have a little red icon at the top of your phone indicating that you're screen recording at that time. And then you just swipe down again and click it to stop uh, like you saw there at the end of my video. Now for me, I do a lot of videos that require apps to set them up, so I rely heavily on screen recording. So I'm very glad that Android has finally added this to the operating system, just built in directly. It creates a little movies folder in your gallery as well, which of course for me, uh, being on a Pixel, it automatically backs up. That's where you access them. You can download them straight off your Google Photos. Smooth and easy. I think that's gonna do it for this video. Kind of short, sweet, to the point. Just wanted to show it to you so you can see what it's like. If you can, click that like button, click subscribe down below, and we will see you in the next video. Deuces. closes tomorrow so this is our last time at the pool mm. <laughs> it's cold <laughs> goodbye to the pool for 2020